What's going on? Cam with Monument Limited. Welcome to the print life. I did not realize it's Friday the 13th. Happy Friday the 13th, everybody. I overslept today. Big time. When you do a lot of work with the people from the other side of the world, you're, you have to be up when they're up to get shit done, but it fucks your clock all up. And I pay the price by going to bed late and waking up late. All your notes, mm -hmm. all that beautiful shit, uh, go into Drive or One, whichever one you like better. All your how-to, I want like list it up okay. and save it. I started the website to make things easier, right? Like to make things easier for us and for the clients. So we do the mock-ups, we send them to them, and then they, we just wait and we wait and we wait for them to approve these goddamn mock-ups. I have no answers to the solution right now. All right, Alex, I'm gonna go to Circle K. Do you need anything? Um, you got your blue do? I got it. Starbucks Frappuccino things. Uh, oh, the iced one? Hey! This is like a kind of an ecosystem, ultimately, right? Okay, what it does, you raise fish in here, fish in the barrel. Yep. Uh, usually tilapia, water being removed from here, uh -huh. pumped up run into each one of these trays just like this is doing now coming out dropping down into the overflows each yeah. overflow is connected in and runs right back into the tank yeah to be clear the fish shit is going to feed the vegetables right and the, and vice versa the vegetables that you remove when you're pulling you know dead leaves or whatever yeah, yeah, yeah. you throw them in here and feed the fish that's sick so the All right, i'm going to circle k Mind is gone completely blank. What was I gonna talk about? Forgot. Morning. Thank you. Thank you. you too. I remembered what I wanted to talk about. Uh, basically, it's the direction of the business and where I'm taking it. Figured I'd update you guys on it. So for the past three years, I've been pretty much running the whole shop, taking all the calls, answering all the emails, and I've burnt the hell out. Because I'm burnt out, this year, really only about a month, maybe a month and a half ago, I put Alex on the phone. So what I'm trying to do is replace myself as the general manager and create a general manager out of my former printer, Alex. The reason for that, hang on, let me cross the street. I want to focus my efforts on marketing and promotion, partially with these videos and then just with like, you know, general AdWords campaign and working on SEO and shit like that and stop running the business. Look at my hat. It got these creases in it. What the fuck happened? I don't remember setting on it. I gotta get a new one. One of the reasons it took me so long to get myself off the desk and put someone else on it, actually there's two reasons. First one, a general manager, I wanted to have printing experience, so I couldn't just hire anybody off the street. The second reason it took so long was well, my original system was like antiquated. It was like an old school invoicing system. You had to manually do everything, all the calculations. So quoting and invoicing and, and just client management was a pain in the ass and it took forever. So the beginning of, of 2016, I started building the website and I planned it to only take about three months, but it ended up taking like the full year to develop. Uh, so during that time, I was just kind of patiently waiting for it to be finished so that I could put someone else on it. Now that it is done, <clears throat> more or less, I don't think a site's ever done, but now that it's kind of near completion, I can confidently put somebody on the phones, managing clients, and, and I have a system in place that's trainable. So it's not super complicated to learn the process. And the really cool thing about our new system is it's like infinitely scalable. So we can handle one client a day, we can handle a thousand clients a day. 
That's awesome. Per usual, the site is showing us another problem. Clients log in and create a quote, then they save that quote. For some goddamn reason, the quotes are disappearing uh, after a week or two. <sighs> okay, so it's not that it's disappearing. The link is disappearing off of their dashboard. Exactly, yeah. Okay. So we just tested it out. The link, or the quote still exists on the website. What seems to be happening is the link okay, to the quote is disappearing from the client's account. To the saved card. And then just let them know at the end of everything, say, uh, please confirm that you have read this and understand the issue. If you have any questions, be sure to ask before you start working. So I love Friday the 13th. <laughs>